Hey guys, it's Carrie. I've got lots of interesting animals and facts today. Indian elephant. An elephant skin can be up to 2.5 centimeters thick on some parts of its body. It is also loose and looks like the elephant's wearing baggy pants. But there's a good reason for this. It keeps the elephant cool by trapping moisture that takes longer to evaporate. And even though it's thick, an elephant skin is also very sensitive to touch and sunburn. Elephants often spray themselves with water or roll in the mud or dust for protection from the sun and biting insects. Asian elephants live in India, Nepal, and parts of Southeast Asia. Their habitat is scrub forest and rainforest, and they are often found along rivers during the dry months. Please subscribe, like, and turn on notifications. Tiger, Amur, or Siberian tigers have the palest orange coat and the fewest stripes to help them blend in with their snow-covered habitat as they live in a very cold climate. The Siberian tiger's coat grows longer and thicker than other tiger subspecies. They also develop a layer of fat for insulation. The beautiful Bengal tiger is the most common subspecies. Indochinese tigers live in Southeast Asia and they are about 20% smaller than the Bengal tigers. Malayan tigers live on the Malay Peninsula. There are only about 80 breeding adults there. The Sumatran tiger has a darker orange coat. It is native to dark jungle habitat on the island of Sumatra. The sides of the face have longer fur, perhaps as protection against jungle plants. The South China tiger is extinct in the wild. Giraffe. There are nine subspecies. The subspecies have different coat patterns and live in different parts of Africa. Giraffe coat colours vary from light tan to practically black. The difference occurs due to what the giraffes eat and where they live. This Papo giraffe looks a bit like a Maasai giraffe. They have a pattern on them that looks like oak leaves. Just like humans, giraffes have seven neck vertebrae. For giraffes, however, each one can be over 25 centimeters in length. Both males and females have two distinct hair-covered horns called Aussie cones. Male giraffes use their horns to spar, throwing their necks against each other. As a male matures, calcium deposits begin to form on his skull to protect it when he headbutts with other males. These calcifications can be quite pronounced and give the strange appearance of a three to five horned giraffe. Giraffes are so big that they don't really need to hide from predators. There is safety in numbers. It's hard to pick out one giraffe from another when they form a tight group. Only lions and crocodiles hunt them. If they have to, giraffes defend themselves with a deadly kick, karate style. Their speed, the way they move, and their body designs also help them to escape predators if they need to. Giraffes have a way of moving, or gait, in which both the front and back legs on one side move forward together then the other two legs on the other side move forward. It's called pacing. Giraffes can run very fast, up to 56 kilometers per hour for short distances. 
giraffes are often the early warning signal for other savanna wildlife. If a giraffe herd starts to run, everyone else does too. Chimpanzee The males are much larger than the females and they have a multi-male to multi-female mating system meaning they are promiscuous. Essentially male chimps copulate with any female at any time they can. A female therefore may contain sperm from multiple partners at any one time which puts the sperm itself and not just the animals that produce it into direct competition. For this reason Male chimpanzees have evolved huge testicles in order to produce a massive amount of sperm multiple times a day. Copulation is brief, lasting approximately 7 seconds. Both gorillas and chimpanzees possess a baculum bone in their penis. Lion Lions usually hunt at night particularly at dusk and dawn, with lionesses doing most of the work. A lion chasing down prey can run the length of a football field in six seconds. Their eyes have a horizontal streak of nerve cells which improves their vision following prey across a plane. Lions have been spotted taking down prey as large as buffalo and giraffes. They may even drag this heavy prey into thickets of brush to keep other wildlife from getting it. Lions digest their food quickly which allows them to return soon for a second helping after gorging themselves the first time. Prime habitat for lions is open woodlands, thick grassland and brush habitat where there is enough cover for hunting and denning. These areas of grassland habitat also provide food for the herbivores lions prey upon. Zebra They have excellent hearing and eyesight and can run at speeds of up to 56 kilometers per hour. They have a powerful kick that can cause serious injury to a predator like a lion, a hyena or an African wild dog. Usually the lead male of the herd called a stallion sounds the alarm if danger is spotted and stays at the back of the group to defend against predators if necessary while the mares and foals run away. Zebras often trot. Their hard hooves are designed to withstand the impact of their body weight and to run easily over rocky ground. When resting at night, zebras lie down while one stands watch to prevent an ambush. Please stay and watch another video with me. I love to read and reply to all of your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.